human beings are scientists. It's as simple as that. You don't have a choice in the matter. It's whether or not you express that in your career. 60% water and 40% other stuff. It affects everything that we are and that we do. I, I love science and I hope my love of my science comes across in the shows that we do and the stuff that we present. The liquid nitrogen show started because, uh, as in my job, I have to explain science to people. I'm paid to do that. And um, I was chatting to my family and I just thought it would be great fun to put on a show and use you, my family, in this show. I didn't know what I was letting myself in for. My daughter is only five. We wanted to involve the audience, we wanted to show stuff, but we also wanted to, a little bit of our personality and family dynamic to come into it too, to kind of make it more accessible. So sort of, this is just our family talking about, you know, liquid nitrogen, as you do. We all threw, you know, our ideas into the mix. Um, we knew also the science that we wanted to explain to the public. Okay, you ready? This is going to be very, very cold, so whatever you do, do not touch. My favourite part about the show was just looking out at the sea of faces out there and seeing people enjoying me talking about science. Uh, liquid nitrogen can be used to tell a lot of really interesting stories. One of the things that we do is uh, we recreate an experiment that was done by the Greeks nearly 2,000 years ago. They kind of invented the steam engine. And we use a ping pong ball and we put the ping pong ball, it's got a hole in it, into the liquid nitrogen. The air inside the ping pong ball condenses, which means it changes from a gas into a liquid. And then because there's a vacuum in there that then sucks in more of the liquid nitrogen that's in the container that we've got it in. And when you take that out and you put it onto a tray, it, it warms up. And so the gas expands, the liquid inside boils and hairs out through the little hole. The ball then whizzes around quite fantastically in a circle. Um, and it's really, really impressive to watch. The great thing about liquid nitrogen is that it is so cheap, it's 14p a litre, so you can use it quite a lot, you can splash it around. A lot of people after the show say to me, where can I get some liquid nitrogen now? Because I've seen what you do with it, it looks great fun. Um, it's delivered by the British Oxygen Corporation and they do a sort of milk round with it. You can't buy it through the post, no. You can buy carbon dioxide through the post, bizarrely. You can order off them and get that and it will appear on your doorstep frozen solid carbon dioxide, which is about minus 77 Celsius. It's just as dangerous. In fact, it's more dangerous than liquid nitrogen. Click the videos to watch more Londoners and don't forget to subscribe. <laughs>